store and pick up this Goliath fit. Typically I hold the camera with my right hand. I got the stuff. Holy mother of God. <laughs> I told you. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so we just pulled up to uh, PetSmart, all right? Me and Casey, I got Casey driving, don't you worry. Um, so we pulled up to PetSmart, we're about to go into the uh, store and pick up this Goliath fish, guys. This fish is three years old. Someone gave him up because they could no longer take care of him and I'm gonna adopt him and take good care of him. So, oh, you can't really see the Petco sign. But, I will see you guys inside Petco. If they tell me I can't film, I'm just gonna pull out my phone and take some shots of him. But, I will see you guys in Petco. We're gonna pick this guy up. Peace. All right guys, so we made it. Um, we're walking in to go see this fish, Casey and I. Typically I hold the camera with my right hand so you guys can see the wall, but is he still here? Yeah. Oh, his name's Bubba. Name. His name is Bubba? There he is, guys. It is a three-year-old red devil, and he is a big boy. He isn't looking too hot. This is his fourth day, fifth day, in this really tiny tank. So we're gonna adopt him. It's free of charge. Um, Let's go find a guy to get this guy out of here and give him a new home. Ooh. And guys, they left a note just for me, Derek, picking up Monday or Tuesday. Dress coat. So I will grab a. Uh, since I have a 125, I'll grab the big one. I got the stuff. What did you get? He is not doing too hot. I think we're getting here just none. Is he still breathing? Yeah, but he won't. He won't come up with my fingers like he was last time we were here. Well, he's been stuck in here. He's probably sick of it. Yeah. Nice he is huge. Oh my god. There we go. How's the fit? He's upright? Perfect. Perfect. Oh, good. Yeah, he fits well. Another fish was abandoned in this, so that makes sense. Uh, That's where we get most of our buckets and boxes. Awesome. All right, ready? Okay, guys, we are back. We are at the house. We are at the 125. We need to work quick. This guy wasn't giving a lot of water. He's straight up and down, and he's swimming. Holy shit. I'm talking fast because I'm super excited. I'm going to strap this aerator on so he has a little bit of oxygen while we do some... Um, Drip acclimation because the water is nasty from Petco. So come see how big this thing is. Holy mother of God. <laughs> I told you. He is beefy. I told you. We're going to drip acclimate him. To be in the water for it to work. <laughs> So you see how it's coming out fast? You don't want that. So what you do is, I can't get my thing wet. You kink the hose, make a knot in it. Working on it. And then, there we go. And it's dripping. 
hence the term drip acclimation. So we'll have that dripping for a little bit. Got it? Go to that side? Uh, no, your side. I'm gonna relocate myself. Be free. Oh, there we go. And he is looking good. Oh my god. <laughs> that is a big boy. Now we just gotta name him. In his face. <sighs> yeah, he looks at you. He doesn't even have eyes. I know. He doesn't look like he has eyes. Well, I guess that's where he's gonna chill until he gets less stressed out, but looks like he's fine. All right, so with that, guys, I'm going to end the episode. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share the video with whoever you think would like it. Um, there'll be plenty of feeding videos featuring, I haven't named them yet, so comment down below what you guys think he should be named, but, um, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.